Hey, what's up, dreamers? Welcome back to the Dream Green Show, where we're bringing dreams to life through smart financial investing. Today, we're revisiting a crucial topic with a 2024 twist, how understanding three key principles transform my wealth journey and how it could transform yours too. Basically, how I became rich and you can too. I literally started from nothing. So it's a story that's close to my heart, guys. It's a story that I once lived and that I believe can inspire change in your life too. So whether you're a long time viewer or joining us for the first time, this is a video that you need to see, that you need to hear. It might not be this video that you wanted to see, but this is the video that you needed to see. It's about breaking cycles, leveling up, and forging your own path to riches. So let's go ahead and dive in it. But first, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. Uh, it's completely free and it really helps out this channel more than you can even imagine. Uh, for the price of $0 and just a click of the button, guys, you really are helping me out and I really appreciate all of you guys that's tuning in and watching me, watching this journey. All right, so first up, let's talk about the power of knowledge. That is the first key. The world around us is evolving rapidly, right? Especially in the financial world. If you're running in the same circles, hitting the same roadblocks, it's time for a change. You see, the first step to getting rich is access to information, knowledge. The right kind, right? The right kind open up doors and break barriers. It's about understanding where you are, where you wanna be and what steps you need to get there. Knowledge isn't just power, it's the roadmap to success. And that's why I had to update this video because this step in 2024 has become so much, I'm talking about so much easier. It's almost cheating, I'm telling you. You're gonna bypass years of what I had to go through in just a couple of weeks and maybe just a couple of months when I had to, I'm telling you guys, it made it so much easier. Just stick through the video and you're gonna find out. So let's take a look. Back in the day, I had my fair share of struggles. I've been uh, where you might be right now, juggling bills. Well, you actually gotta own stuff to have to pay bills. I didn't have, I didn't have anything to my name, so. It was tough, guys. So, so let's rewind the clock a little bit. There was a time when my financial situation, let's say it, it wasn't ideal. It wasn't the best. I'm talking about a time where my diet basically consisted of rice. I'm talking, I had plain white rice, brown rice, rice with salt, rice with some rosemary on top, rice with garlic powder on top. I had any kind of rice you could think of. That's why I had to eat. That's what, that's the only thing I had at the time, right? Days when my, my, when my refrigerator wasn't, working when I had to use an ice chest. The ice chest was my only option. Imagine having to go to the corner store relying on a bag of ice to keep your food from spoiling. That, that, that was my reality, right? My friends, my roommates, we were all in the same boat. I looked to my left, he in the boat. Looked to my right, we all in the same situation. We, we were stuck in a cycle of financial stagnation. This wasn't living, it was surviving. You guys might be experiencing the same things right now. You look to your left, you look to your right, everyone in the same situations, everyone been in the same situation for the last five, six, seven years, ain't really no growth within your circle of friends or circle of communities. It's time for a change and that's when it should hit you and, and that's when it hit me, something had to change. I realized I needed a strategy, a new strategy, a new way of thinking and most importantly, new information. That's when I, I, I dove into the world of investing, finance, business, um, books, online courses, videos. I'm talking about hours were spent reading books, online courses, all of that. I observed any information that I could and trust me, it was a game changer. So when I was learning all of this information, my friends started looking at me real. They was like, man, this dude, he's a nerd for this stuff now. He's a little uh, investor buddy now. He he all into that community. I was bringing them back the information saying, hey, this is how the rich do it. This is how the wealthy do it. This is how you grow wealth. This is what I'm learning. I'm giving you guys the information. And they was like, ah, man, whatever. We are going out to the club this weekend. So when my friends that was going out, they was partying, they was clubbing, they was buying bottles. I was literally buying books, buying online courses, spending money, right? On online courses, uh, spending hours doing research on YouTube, um, leading me to Facebook groups for investing, um, Instagram investing pages. So now, you know, if you view one ad on Instagram, Instagram gonna keep running. So I, I, I liked when all those investor ads just kept going through my IG timeline. I love that. It kept me on track, right? But anyways, look, I dove into every resource that I could find, the, the Warren Buffets of the world, Rich Dad, Poor Dad, the online courses, you name it. 
I was a sponge soaking up all the information, so everything about stocks, businesses, how money works, how money really works. Um, this wasn't just about making money. It was about understanding it. It wasn't about making money. It was about understanding it. I had to say that twice. Now, here's where it gets so much easier in 2024 with AI, right? 2023 was the beginning way. 2024 is going to be even crazier, guys. With AI like ChatGPT, you can literally go to AI and say, hey, summarize this book for me. Hey, you could go to ChatGPT. You could type in and say, hey, I make $36,000 this year. Write me out a plan, a very detailed plan on how I can save a thousand dollars in six months. Give me a budget for my meals. Give me a budget for entertainment. Give me a budget for my bills. Give me a budget for everything to where in the next six months, I will have a thousand dollars saved up. Man, that took me so long back in the day. You guys could do that in a single sentence and a click of a button within AI. Summarize books, online courses, market data analysis. And, and, and here's the kicker, guy. Chat GPT is completely free. 2024 is going to be crazy. So it, all those years and hours I spent, you, you guys could do that at a click of the button. That's why I have to update this video because it's become even easier. This AI boom, man, it can make you millions. So you don't have to do all the hard searching. It's right there at the click of your finger. So knowledge, knowledge should not be an excuse anymore. You can, hey, I can't afford this online course. I can't afford this book. I can't afford this seminar knowledge is not an excuse anymore you guys can find any part anything that you need to know at the click of a button so get rid of the excuse the knowledge so the key point of number one was knowledge let's move on to number two right but here's the kicker guys knowledge without the right mindset is like a car without gas in it it's not going anywhere so the second step the second point to becoming rich was transforming um, my mindset transforming your mindset this was about seeing beyond the immediate gratification, looking at the bigger picture, guys. The mindset is where the real transformation happened. It's a shift from living paycheck to paycheck to planning for the future. It's about seeing your money not just as a means to an end, but as a tool for growth. It's about delayed gratification, understanding that the fact that the financial choices you make today will shape your tomorrow. Now, y'all know my philosophy that has made me rich over the last few years is that I only buy things that I own or from places that I own. For example, let's say I have friends out there that have a thousand, two thousand, three thousand dollars worth of Nike shoes, right? I would not buy any pair of Nike shoes unless I own one single share of Nike inside of my portfolio. I'm not saying that you have to be filthy rich inside of your portfolio. You have to get started somewhere. But let's say I won't buy Coca-Cola unless I own one share of Coca-Cola. I won't buy Pepsi unless I won't own one share of Pepsi inside my portfolio. Now, the grocery store, you can own Walmart. You can buy a ticket symbol WMT. Um, you could buy Target. There's a lot of things out there. Now, I would not buy anything out there unless I owned it. So like Coca-Cola, PepsiCo. I used to go out and buy the same iPhone that they released every single year. I would pay $1,000 for an iPhone and I did not own a single share of Apple. That just didn't make sense to me, guys. So what I did, instead of buying a $1,000 Apple iPhone, I would buy $1,000 worth of Apple stock every single year until I just had to upgrade for the iPhone. And then when I did upgrade for the iPhone, I, made it, I felt okay because I was a part owner of Apple and I had them inside my portfolio. Let, let's just dive into that just a little later so i used to see my friends splurging on shoes technology things that give you a, a momentary high right just oh i got this cool thing i feel real good i used to do the same thing chasing that short-lived happiness that short-term gratification i feel happy for a week then i feel like i have to buy something else again the following week in order to feel that same happiness again that's a very very weak mindset after my financial enlightenment my approach to spending money transformed drastically. So instead of blowing money on depreciating assets, I started to investing into appreciating ones. Let's talk about those $1,000 a month shoes purchases, right? Imagine if half of that went into the stock instead. Only a piece of Nike, instead of just wearing it, that shifts uh, you from a consumer to an investor mindset. It ships you from a consumer to an investor. It's about building wealth, not just displaying it. Uh, and this brings us to the third most crucial step, ownership. Wealth isn't just about how much cash you have on hand. It's, it's about what you own. Stocks, real estate, businesses, assets that will work for you. 
because if you just own one share of any stock, just one share of any stock, you are now part owner of these companies. Now I could go and buy some Nike shoes, right? Because I'm now part owner of Nike. I could go buy a 12 case of Coke because I'm now part owner of Coke. I'm telling you guys, it feels completely different once you get started. If you if you watched the video from two years ago, let me know down in the comment section how much different you feel now that you're the owner of these companies, right? All right, so now that we're in 2024, the world has changed again, and so have the opportunities, right? The stock market has evolved, new industries have emerged, and the way we invest has transformed today with platforms like Moomoo, Moo, Webull, Robinhood, and other investing platforms, it made becoming an investor so much easier. Right now, guys, there's no excuse. I promise you guys, this is the one thing that you need to do right now. I want you guys to go and open up an account. You could go down to the description, click Moomoo, Moo, sign up, deposit $100, and you could get up to 15 free stocks. 15 free stocks that got a 5.1 cash creep interest. That is by far the easiest way to get started. I'm gonna leave a link in the description to Moomoo as well. I mean, to Weibo as well. You click that, you sign up, deposit a dollar if you want to. Even anybody can find a dollar. It's not that hard to get started. You deposit a dollar, you could get up to 12 free stocks with Weibo and you could keep those stocks inside the platform and decide to use it or you could sell all those free stocks and withdraw of your money guys is literally free money now this is how different it was back when i made this video two years ago you could get five free stocks now you could get 12 free stocks the 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 opportunity has not been any better since then i'm telling you the game has changed the investing world has changed and for you to get started with free stocks that is the best opportunity to get started you guys need to do that now so even if you already have Weeble, sign up with Moomoo, get free stocks. If you already have Moomoo, sign up with Weeble, get free stocks. All right, so now that you have your broker, I want you to only start shopping or buy a stores that you own and have inside of your portfolio. And I promise you, your spending habits will change. If you only have $25, right? If you only invest in $25 a month and you start off with that, that's fine. But once you start to see how your money is actually start to work for you, I promise you, you're gonna find a way to turn that $25 investing a month into $50 a month. And then once you see that money start to work with you, you're gonna turn that $50 of investing per month into $100 per month, because now you are building wealth. You are building wealth by becoming part owners of these companies. Just having a little money on you, right? Just having a little money on you does not make you rich. Now, with you having appreciating assets in your portfolio and your money that you can even pass down to your kids, that makes you rich. Now you are creating generational wealth to where your kids will never have to work a day in their life. So for example, if you, if you even if you have a whole bunch of money, right? Hey, I'm not broke. I have $50,000, but you don't own anything. And you keeping all $50,000 inside of your Wells Fargo account. And at the end of the day, over a entire year, you're going to receive your 0.001 interest in your saving account. So your $50,000 at the end of the year is going to make you $50,000 and $10. $50,000 and $10 over the course of a year, just because you got your money inside your account. Are you rich? No, you just made ten dollars. Your money is not working for you now. Let's say if you just took out half of that twenty-five thousand dollars and invested that into the actual company, Wells Fargo. Right now, you're a part owner of the bank that you bank at. And check this out: Wells Fargo is a dividend-paying stock. That means four times a year, they're quarterly paying dividend stock. That means four times a year, they're gonna pay you dividends for saying, "Hey, thank you for investing inside the company." They pay it back to their investors, part owners like you, and their dividend aristocrats. They increase their dividends every single year for the last 25 years, and they have a dividend rate of four something percent. I think. Correct me if I'm wrong down in the comment section. I'm pretty sure I'm wrong, but just off the top of my head, guys, um, now you're gonna be making. $25,000 for four payments per year in dividends and their stock could go up over time. That's an appreciating asset. Could it get pulled back? It could, but history shows that um, if you're looking at good quality companies over the last 60 years, Wells Fargo has been doing okay, right? So there you go. Now you're making more money. You have your money working for you. You have your money. Wells Fargo could appreciate. You have your dividends coming in from Wells Fargo. And guys, if you say, hey, I don't know what to invest in. I'm a new investor. Well, they have these things called ETFs like VRO and QQQ. VRO tracks the top 500 companies in America, right? So if you buy any ETF, any stock, and you want to get started, VRO might be the easiest to 
have the America's top 500 companies. Therefore, you be covered. You could go to any store, buy anything that you want. Nine times out of 10, 10 times out of 10, that company is going to be inside of um, VOO or the S&P 500. And that has you covered with America's top 500 companies. So that would be the easiest way to get started is to invest inside a, a easy ETF that covers 500 companies inside of one portfolio like that to consumer VRO or QQQ. QQQ chops the, the top technology companies. VRO top, uh, tracks the top 500 companies in America. Therefore, you will be covered. You can go buy Apple products, Nike products, uh, Coca Cola, Pepsi. You could go buy anything you want. But me, if I was getting started, that would be the easiest way to go. So in 2024, the principles remains the same, but the context has evolved. Right, the world's the world's faster. It's more connected. Uh, opportunities in stocks, crypto, even starting your own venture, uh, is at our fingertips just like that. But without the foundation of knowledge, the right mindset, and the focus on ownership. Navigating this world can be, it can be overwhelming. And that's why you guys need to subscribe so you don't miss out on any future videos and update videos so you don't miss out on any crucial information. But yeah, thank you guys for joining me on this journey today. If this video has inspired you, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button for more empowering content and share it with someone, right? Share it with who you think might need to hear this message. Um, your support means the world to me and it helps brings the Dream Green Show reach and inspire to more dreamers like you. So before I sign out, I want to let you guys go down in the comment section and let me know how, if you started your investing journey back when I made that video in 2022, let me know how has it planned out. If you're one of those people that, that invest inside Nike, right? Go buy all the shoes, the thousand dollars worth of shoes and let it depreciate and don't own any Nike. Let me know down in the comment section. But if you're that Nike guy that buy Nike shoes and flip those for a bigger profit, kudos to you because there are people out there that are hustlers. That's a side hustle, right? You have to actually know how to side hustle. It is a skill. So I'm not talking about you guys as buying shoes and flipping them. I'm not talking about you guys. I'm talking about the guys that just buy shoes to look cool and, and then they depreciate and then they broke again. I'm not, that's the people I'm talking about. I'm not talking about you guys that's flipping shoes. Kudos to you. But yeah, I want to hear all about your investing um, opportunities and journeys down in the description. Um, but other than that, I'm Zeke, bringing you the Dream Green Show. And I'm out. Peace.